Um, my name is Kim Scarzi. I'm a professor in the Department of Pharmacy Practice and Science, and I'm part of the Clinical Pharmaceutical Sciences track. So the Clinical Pharmaceutical Sciences track aims to train students in both basic and applied research skills, often in the area of pharmacology, so what the drug is doing to the body. Um, we aim to train students to become translational scientists. Our work ranges from basic uh, lab-based studies to clinical trials in humans. And the translational part of that is bringing it all together and really bringing the bench to the bedside. In addition to our, the standard core courses that you would take as part of the Pharmaceutical Sciences graduate program, we offer some courses in advanced pharmacokinetics, particularly if we're enrolling students who have already been in a PharmD program or other pharmacokinetics experience. Um, we have a pharmacogenetics required course to help you understand how pharmacogenetics and how the host can affect how drugs work. And we have two courses in biostatistics. Within the track, we have seven core faculty members who are all funded by various sources, including the National Institutes of Health. We have a diverse range of expertise, including uh, HIV and infectious diseases, pediatrics, and pulmonary diseases, and oncology. I think that breadth of, of uh, expertise in various clinical areas offer the students a lot of different opportunities to work with different faculty members in different areas. Graduates from the Clinical Pharmaceutical Sciences track should be very competitive in areas across academia, uh, industry, so drug companies, or perhaps the government, such as the FDA. Um, having the broad spectrum of translational science training gives them the skills that make them a very desirable candidate um, for the, those postings within any of those areas. I'll give you an example of my current student, Michelle Pham, who is working with um, one of my uh, clinical studies to do population PK modeling um, to predict the, the drug disposition and predict appropriate dosing of that medication. She's just finished a summer internship, a uh, paid internship with uh, Merck, and she hopes to do a, a subsequent summer internship with the FDA next summer, but we still hope to keep her in academia. So if you're a student who is interested in a wide range of things, from working on a bench all the way through to clinical trials in humans, and everything in between, we think that our track may be something you should consider. Um, please reach out to us if we can offer you any information or additional support as you make your choice.